How you been? You know, it's been a hot minute. Uh, I'm in a I'm in a spot of bother at the moment, Forehebs. Are you aware of anything that's been going on with uh the Hydra raids up in the mirror uh, park? I mean, I heard some shit, but I don't really I don't really know. Okay, I can fill you in. Um, so Air One followed Arnie back to the main house. Oh, and the main house was in my name. Um, and had. A substantial amount of stuff in it to the point where I, I was told by someone who's still close to PD who they apparently just give information away nowadays. Um, they said that there's three evidence lockers filled with stuff that they've taken and one of those evidence lockers is guns. Well, does it happen to be a... Uh, did it happen to be a, a Draco? An SMG? EMP guns? Is that what you got confiscated? Um, I can show you the list of stuff if you want. Because uh, I'll be honest with you. Um, PD called me up. And they're like, yo, come down to MRPD. <laughs> you got that cool too. Yeah. And Mana did as well. And they started like, they started like showing me like a whole load of guns. And they were like, yo, I'll pay you a hundred K. If you give me information on these weapons. But at the time, I didn't even know what the fuck was going on. You know what I'm saying? A hundred K. Yeah, they said they'd give me a hundred K for any information. These guys are fucking desperate. What did you say? I said, yeah, I got you, big dog. I'm not saying go tell them shit, but... You know. Fuck, you come to the front. Fuck. Okay. I mean, that's good. That's good for the plan that I've got, anyway. So, uh... The reason why I wanted to speak to you guys, well, I, actually, just to say as well, I now have a warrant out for my arrest, but I don't know how bad it is. But given everything that's on that list, it could be really bad. I also don't have a statute of limitations, which means that if they find a gun in there that's nine months old with like a shootout that happened nine months ago, they could charge love me. More, love more. You look at the list, love more. You want to read it out? You want to read out the list? We don't have enough time. <laughs> okay. Just read, out the, just read out the main parts of it. Uh, give me one second. This is not good, my man. <laughs> no, it's fucking awful. It's really bad. Um, but, uh, you know, I've got Crane and I have uh, Robin for my legal team. Mm, so, okay, you're we'll in see. good hands. I think so, yeah. he came. Uh, Robin came recommended, obviously, Crane I know from years and years ago. So, um, so reason why I called you guys is because I'm putting together a little plan. Um, one of the main people that was named, uh, before I even got the raid warrant, I had the names of the officers that were involved in the situation. People, people really talk a lot in that police department. Like, holy shit. Um, and, um, I was given Denzel Shiesty, Haley Maxwell, and Vincent Ventura as the first three names. I now have others, but those three are the priority. And I've got a bit of a plan for Denzel. Um, have you ever seen a movie called Phone Booth? Oh, yeah, I have. The sniper rifle yeah. in the phone booth and the guy stuck in there? Yeah, Denzel's going to be the guy in the booth. Mm. Um, now, my idea is I would, if possible, very much appreciate it if Hood News were there to report on the situation as it, as it goes on. Oh, With so the you, idea you want that, that, you want that shit live? Yes. I also want it to gather a crowd. So okay. once a crowd is potentially gathered by yourselves... I'm going to force Denzel to shout out to everybody in the crowd every, everything that he's done that's wrong. And if he lies to me, or if I think he's doing saying the wrong things, or he's bullshitting, he'll, he'll die. And it's either going to be through an explosive or through a sniper rifle. I haven't quite decided yet. But that's the plan for the time being. Mm. Um, is that something you guys would be interested that's... in getting involved in? Let me, let me tell you something. Let me tell you something about Denzel Shiesty. Anytime I get a chance to fuck that motherfucker over, I'm in for it. You know what I'm saying? So, so Perfect. this to me, hey, this, hey, this to me, sounds like a great plan. What do you think, Lovemore? I read you out this list quickly. Yeah, That's go the ahead. first page. <laughs> read out the list. Go ahead. Times two, AR ten M, F. What's that? M four. What is that? It's a PD class two. Times four, GC seventeen X. Times 15 PD chest armor. Times one flashlight. Times one combat rifle. Times three tactical rifle. <laughs> times six combat PDW. Times five pump shotgun. Times one EMP launcher. 
times 14, GC19X. Times 13, M19. Times 15, makeshift 911. Times one, ranting rifle. Ranting rifle. Times 32, thermite charges. Times 18, GC19 extended magazine. Times 12, DC19 magazine. Times one, hunting rifle magazine. Times 20, GC19X slide. Moment, we don't have enough time to read all this shit. Yeah. Oh, damn, dog. Uh, yeah. I You're think you guys probably know where the class twos are coming from. How aware are you of the cargo ship and stuff? Uh, well, you know, we've been on it. Might have got a okay. crate or two out of there. I definitely recommend to keep going if you're looking for some interesting stuff. You guys come across any EMP launchers yet? Uh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. That's something they found. Um, so they know about those now, unfortunately. Um, so, okay, perfect. Um, I'm Let really glad you're on question, board for that. Dog. Yeah. So how, how you plan to get Denzel? I don't know if you ever met. I don't know if you've really met Denzel Shaisi, but this motherfucker has to be the most paranoid guy that there is. Like this, if I've you put, the same. if you pull up to him, and you and you and you even go near his car, gun pulled out. You even you know, like this guy. This guy is so he's got so many enemies. He's got so many ops. He, the paranoia is crazy. A fly goes by mm. him and it gets a little bit too close. He pull out his gun, ready to shoot. You know what I'm saying? So. So I don't know. I don't know how you're planning to get him at the phone booth. I don't. I don't know how you're gonna manage that. But I'm sure you. You know what I'm saying? Like, I can tell you. So yeah. it's actually using uh, pretty much what you just told me regarding the um, you know him requesting information. So, like I said, he already he already spoke to Mana. They didn't tell him anything, and uh, I've asked a member of Mana if they would be interested in potentially saying to Denzel, hey. Uh, we found some information about that class two shit you're interested in. Meet us at this location. We'll go through some stuff, etc. In the most believable way possible. Ideally, that will be enough to tempt him to go over there. I, I, I'm, I'd be surprised if he if he dipped out on a chance at that. You know, and if they're saying it's you know if they give a convincing enough story about the information or maybe give him a bit of a sneak. Uh, thing on the phone and then to entice him a bit that could work too but th that's the plan at the moment i think yeah i think the only way that works is if you actually tell him something that seems legit or believable yeah. on the phone yep like, you know like a little uh like you said right ah uh, uh, you got this big dog uh, you know what i'm saying like you, you could figure this shit out yeah at the same time i have uh two separate groups going after another two people that are involved in this situation so i'm pretty fortunate i know a lot of people around the city so i've been able to get quite a lot of help so i appreciate you guys very much for being up for this because it should be interesting as uh, yeah i mean you let me know whenever you need me and I'll, I'll pull up with my team we'll get we'll get the new the new screw rolling we'll get the footage going get that shit going live uh, and then you know we'll see what happens Fucking excellent news. I appreciate that, Fords. That is that is fucking great. I thank you. Of course, big dog. Is there anything that I can do for you, then you just ask. Nah, you're good. You're good. Just let me know where and when, you know what I mean? I got you. I'll let you know. I better get out of here because I gotta go and swap my car. They were outside my safe house the other day. Oh. Did you know any, ever know anyone called Olivia Copper? No. I don't you know you know, you know somebody trooper. named me? Nah, I don't think no, so. No. Okay. All right. Well, someone that I used to work with uh, a lot back in state police, and um, she was she was actually there before I was. And the other day, I was at my safe house, and a marshal car pulls up, and someone gets out looking exactly like Olivia. It freaked me the fuck out, but there's no fucking way it's her. So I think it's the marshal trying to fuck with me. So I have to return the favor. I've also told them that if they plan on going up in the air, then they better call me first. Otherwise, they'll find out what's going on and who belongs, to, who owns the skies. Mm. It's, uh, mm. I had some trouble with uh, Air One the other day after they attempted to go and fly, apparently. I um, may have gained access to the hangar to fuck around with some of it a little bit. <laughs> All right. But yeah, uh, if you guys need anything, let me know, um, and I'll get in touch with you as soon as I have a day and time in mind for this idea. 
was big. Hey, I'm gonna be honest though. Like, week. it's a good disguise. I would have never guessed this is you. You know what I mean? I would have thought like, like RJ or somebody. Perfect. That's fucking it's really perfect. really good disguise. They, I, I, a lot of them don't know my past and don't know the things that I've managed to do as a trooper. And now I don't have any SOPs or laws to follow. So, I'm a free man. I would say. All right, I better get out of here, but I appreciate you guys. I'll see you soon, okay? All right, big dog. If you need anything, you let me know, all right? Oh, well. I gotta go get a plane. There's money right here. Let me pick that shit up. It's mine. I really want their ass.